Hello, my name is Art Thomas. I've lived in Clareton for over 70 years. Uh, Dorian Johnson just told my wife's story. My wife also suffers from uh, neuroscarcodosis. It started out as scarcodosis when she first got that. Like I say, I'm 78 years old, by the way. Uh, I was on safety for U.S. SEAL, and I had a chance to go through the Thomas Registry. That's something like a uh, computer of the old years. Books, book, big books. And I looked up scarcodosis, and it uh, said that scarcodosis came, was found, was found basically in the rural south, where they use coal byproducts to suppress the dust on the roads. That was fine for when it was oily, but after the oil dried out, the dust went up in the air and the people breathed it and they got scarcodosis. Now, I think I found out the day that Clareton Mill is 121 years old. And I did have a little chemistry in high school. And I learned one basic rule. What goes up must come down. And that's been coming down in the city of Clareton for over 100, uh, for 121 years? Come on. And U.S. still gets fines. People in Clareton don't get anything from their fines. I understand one year the health department redecorated their offices with the fine money from U.S. Steel. I can't get enough from U.S. Steel to pay for me taking my wife back and forth to the hospital, to pay for the gas. This is ridiculous. And every time you turn around, it's a bad air alert. Also, I was surprised to find out today that we were also in the top 1% for cancer, lung diseases, and there was a heart, disease, heart failure too, I believe it was. When you're in the top 1% of something and it's bad, I mean, come on. You, some, something has to give. You still can either clean up the rack or shut the place down. And that goes for the rest of the facilities in Mon Valley that are putting out pollution. Or at least this president is talking about cleaning the air up. I don't see anything happening clear in the middle. Every time I turn around, it seems like it's getting worse. So, like I say, I used to plant a garden. I can't even plant a garden now. Can't eat the vegetables out of the garden. Used to have fruit trees. There's some. I used to know where every fruit tree in Clareton was when I was young and coming up. And it is around here. I mean, I can't think of fruit tree around. I planted peach trees, cherry trees, everything dies. I even had a pine tree die. I'm about, I'm about done. I'm fed up with it. And like, like, like they said, you can't afford to move out of this place. I get a U.S. <laughs> pension. And trust me, it's not that much the way prices are going up today. I'm, I'm about done. I'm, I'm done with it. I, I, I hope that we can get some help from the talk.